Yes, my friend, my good friend, then say you're free again. My good friend, morning has broken like the first morning. Blackbird have spoken like the first verb or uh, bird. Praise for the singing. <laughs> Life, sir. Oh boy, good morning, guys. You need to remember that you were like. <laughs> 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 good morning good morning guys good morning bear with us a little bit we're we're, we're doing um i'm sharing lashan good morning studying good morning i'm sharing i'm sharing sharing is here <laughs> Sometimes you have to do these things in a bend. Good morning to you, Miss Holly. Good morning, Miss Holly. Good morning to you. Um, let me see. Um, yeah, guys, please share share the information too. As you can see by the the, the thumbnail this morning or the title, we are going different this morning. Uh huh. Just click. Just click on the link to jump. See when you're not when you're not you know when you have when you do remedial um reading you have to talk out when you have to type because otherwise your head you not go wait in there, you not go get it so 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 well. All right. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Morning! The beard, I come, it I come, it I come. Trying with the beard, trying the beard. Beverly Weekly, good morning. Uh, Paulette Harrison from Portmore, Jamaica. Paulette, you, you are, that, that breakfast here is for you. Because Portmore full of cactus. Let me just tell you from now. The breakfast are for you, Paulette. <laughs> ben Charles, good morning, good morning. Try Graham, good morning, good morning to all my peeps. Remember to like, share, subscribe, and all these things. Yeah, we are taking Yada Belly TV to another level. Another level. Good morning from DeSoto, Texas. DeSoto's in the house. Hey, Texas is in the house. Whoa. Baby, baby, come on. Baby, baby, come on. Baby. Uh, when you walk by every night. Talking shit and look. All right, all right, all right. Enough of that. Yeah. Whew. I must get away from me this morning, but I pull it back. Glory. AJ, good morning to you, sir. Good morning from Portmore. Portmore's in the house. Hey. Catherine's in the house. Whoa. Whoa. And and remember, I said Portmore they pan lockdown, so you know if you, if you can't find certain things. I think it was lifted, or did they extend it again? You was mad yesterday, did get the right plate. I, I don't understand that one. Good morning, Simone Kelly. Good morning. Simone is in the... <laughs> oh, my God. Miami in the house. So, Miami in the house and so flow in the house and we are here because we are here. Yes, loving on Jesus, thanking God for another day. It's been a good day. Um... So we have to work out this thing, you know, with fear and trembling. Guys, I am, I am, I am all about trying new things. That's my mantra. Trying new things. Yeah? You know? Otherwise known as. Thank you, see. She's just a good, such a good, um, reverb, reverb, 
reverberer. I can I call it that? Reverberer? Yeah. Okay, she's a good reverberer. I was mad yesterday, did get the right plate. Pate. You was mad yesterday, did get the right pate. Oh, the pate. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> oh, the blog. <laughs> Beverly, yeah, I'm a friend them Beverly. I mean, that's why I'm not cuss them. I'm a friend them. I'm not really have to war them. But yeah, them owe me a hockey party. I'm, as a matter of fact, thank you, Beverly. I'm going up there today for my hockey party. Them too bright. No? Mm -mm. Very much too bright. A big, big tree dollar. Big, big tree dollar. Them give me dollar 90 party. No, uh -uh, it's not going to work. It's not going to Right. Let me just tell you from now, all right? So guys, without further ado, we are making a very, very unique dish this morning. And again, one of Yadabelli's original recipes. Never did it before, never had it before. But my whole idea is we have to start living subsistently, one. And two, we have to start living outside of the box. That's two. So now we're gonna be making sure that we utilize what we have when we can find it and turn around and make fashion. See, can you come say hello, let me run the um, comb my beard. Can my beard look, my beard look very, very scanty and look away. May I go comb my beard? Soon come. Oh, you guys, he's just forcing me. I'm washing the dishes and I have to come be a filler. That's what I am this morning, a filler. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Yeah, so what was he saying? He was saying we have to get in the habit of, you know, exercising some subsistence living. And this is exactly what this is because these tuners are actually from our neighbor. Yeah, we didn't steal them. I don't know it has tuna in my What is cactus? Yeah, I think some people call it tuna. Only That's... Jamaicans. Oh, okay. So, yeah, we, we, we didn't steal it from our neighbor. We got it from our neighbor's <laughs> yard. But let's say like we're on lockdown, we have to eat anything, so go on with the cactus. Yes. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, me start to try to shave it, um, um, comb it, it, it not really works, so bear with me. Barrington Christian, good morning to you, sir. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, we have to get serious now, because Barrington Christian, there. Yeah! <laughs> oh, is, is, a, is the lady talking to you now? <laughs> All right, I'm, I'm I'm trying to understand that Barrington, but let's get let's get it on Ben Charles. Good morning, good morning. The two gift set arrived yesterday. Big up yourself, Ben Charles. Thank wow. you so much wow. for uh, patronizing the uh, One True Natural. We appreciate you, sir. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right, guys. As you can see, I am making cactus. This, ladies and gentlemen, Jamaica, we call it tuna. It is super good for washing your hair, making sure your hair is nice. It also works on blemishes on your skin. That's the application that we have known for many years that tuna is good for your skin and it's good for your hair. So we use it in that fashion, ex externally as a homemade remedy for you know hair and dandruff and all these things. If you have dandruff, dry scalp, this thing here, 100% good for you. And we have always known this. This is a Jamaican thing. Now I am coming to find out that this is called Nopalis. And it is an edible cactus. And mostly people from Mexico and other Latin countries know of this. And I've been using it for years. Cooking it, putting it in taco, making sauces and different dishes with it. And because Yada Belly TV is very enough and very curious and inquisitive. I have decided to make a dish with this this morning. Yes, yes, yes. The last time you say she wasn't talking to you. <laughs> oh, okay, Barrington. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, she talked to me this morning, Barrington. She talking to me this morning. Barrington, we had to make up. We had to make up. It was a, it's a, it's a serious thing because you, you get to that point where you have to make up. Otherwise, you're going to lose your spot. So, hey, we work on the making up and that's what happened. So guys, this Nopalis, our, our, our cactus, is, is a very interesting um, thing. And I, I thought to myself, I would show you guys how it is prepared by those persons who know it as food. And we're going to also make the attempt to utilize it in our own cooking. 
Now the first thing I need to show you with this is that these little pads, if you can, let me see if I can show you. If you notice it has a little, um, these little things on it, these little, what you call them now? What would I call them? Like prickly, you know, these little maca, you know, or, or, or um, what you call them? Thorns, these are like very prickly. All right, good morning, Ayeta uh, Glenn. Um, did I pronounce it right? And it has these thorns on it. So the whole idea is you may not see them, but it has very fine thorns. All right, so we're going to try to get those off. And how do we do that? We take our knife, and you don't try to touch it too much, otherwise you hurt yourself. You take your knife, and you use a napkin or you put on gloves, and you just run the knife down the back of it like such and you're gonna do this basically all the way through and when it comes to the sides i'm gonna show you what i do and guys i i i, I again i'm always trying to find new things that can you know change how we eat and then this also what i found out also guys is that this is super good for diabetics it's a very good healthy food all right when it comes to the side now you're gonna just walk your knife and take off the edge the side because the sides have the prickle the little prickles um and that they will get in your finger and if they get in your finger it is hell to pay to take them out all right trust me yeah man so you just the wife says she never heard of this type of food before and neither did I until I did my research. And you see, one of the things with me is that I, I like diving into other cultures, you know, to see what they do and how they do it. Because you might learn, you know, you might learn something. So you see, you get one side off, then you turn it around. And guys, you do the same thing on the other side. The next thing I want you to tell you, tell you is that you, you're, you're going to look for the young ones. You're not going to try to do the, the big tough one then. the younger the better because it's softer easier to cook more manageable all right so give me a sec guys i'm working on it and i'm gonna give you the full the full hundred on this nopalis or cactus or in jamaica we call it tuna tuna cactus you know, I don't know why we call it tuna. I don't know where the, the, the origin of the word came from. I don't know if it's the shape or what, but we call it tuna. And there you have it. Look at that. This is how it looks when it is 100% peeled. And then if you go in some of the Latin stores, you will find this just like this in some of the Latin supermarket already prepared. I'm gonna do one more just for you know, since my habit might as well me just use it. Alright, so it's very very simple guys. You cut off the end down there and you just work on getting the the um the thorns off. Alright. Again, when you get to the sides, you just mark it with your knife. I know that the, I might have um, Latin uh, Americans and or Latin folks watching, so I want to do it justice before I take it to another level with my Jamaican flair. So I want to start out on the right note. So you clean it like such. And guys, there are different varieties of cacti. You hear that, see? You hear the word cacti? Jeez, um, so you have to know which one you use, right? That's why I make sure I show no. Because if I know the right one, some of them might, you might uh, end up eating the wrong thing. So now just go pick cactus and eat it. Make sure experiment and try and find out, you know, do your research and find out what, what is no palace and what is something else. All right. There are comments. You start at where Barrington says if she vexed with me. The lady is talking. <laughs> okay. Morning to you, Shalani Howard. Good morning, Debbie Dakers. Good morning, 
Beverly, good morning to you. Troy, why did you retract your... Oh, there's a message here from Akipati. Them call it Akipati. <laughs> what? One for three dollar. You know, see. Akipati, them call it Akipati. Soon come now. I, what? <laughs> we need a translator for this. All right, hold on. So here we have it. We have our, 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 our Nepalis all um, deformed. So now I'm just gonna clean off my board a little bit and then we move to the, the very next level. <laughs> All right, go ahead, babe. Um, where everything is good. GCB Woods, long time. Long right? time, yep. Blessings, where everyone is good. Very interesting menu this morning. You're gonna have to twist my arm. <laughs> <laughs> and you know, so I'm mean, not gonna have to twist your arm because you're gonna sue up because we're not, we're not done yet, you know. You know, I thought this cactus was the same thing like um, aloe vera, like with the, the same beta taste. Oh no. I don't know why I always thought they were the same thing. All right, so let me wash it right quick. I can't wait till it's cooked. <laughs> Yep, no, we're not juicing it, Shalini. We are cooking it like full out cooking, full out cooking it like a Jamaican dish. So. All right, now the next thing I want to tell you guys about this cactus is that it is slimy. Mm -hmm. When I talk about slimy, I'm talking about like okra slimy. All right, so once you, you de um, thorn it, you want to cut it into strips like such. Did you put this twice already? Yeah, I think so. You could check. Mm. Right, thank you. And then you want to cut it into bite-sized pieces. All right. And you can buy you even while I'm cutting it, I, I can tell you. I can see the, the little slimes, you know. All right, watch this now. You're gonna go again down mm -hmm. the stretch. Down the flank, you go down the flank okay. like a ball, or you go down the flank, then okay. you go across the side, go across the side. Okay. <laughs> so, so, you just want to cut it like this now. Somebody by the name of Dominic Gordon says, Good morning. I'm from Arizona. I'm glad you're doing this. They're everywhere in my area. Wow. And I always wanted to know how to prepare it. Thank you so much. You see, you see, McCann, I inspired one person this morning. It was worth it. It was worth it. AJ, so AJ Jimerson, so what's the name of the dish? It's Nopalis and, well, if you're if you're Jamaican, it is tuna cactus with saltfish. Mm -hmm. If you're American, it is cactus with salted cod. Mm -hmm. And if you are Hispanic or Latin, it is Nopalis in a bacalao. Yes, yes. sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> Talk about. <laughs> Talk about a food connoisseur, knowing things. Oh my God! <laughs> morning, Jocelyn. Good morning to you. <laughs> so there you have it, guys. And as it is now, I don't know if it's edible. So let me. Well, I'm never try. Barrington said, "Don't forget, it's bitter." It's not bitter. It's not bitter. Never try. Let me try. Let me try. Bitter. Wow! See, you have to try this. Come in the camera. Come in the camera. It's super slimy. Come in the camera, see. Just bite it up. Where it tastes? Tastes like a fruit. Like lime. Like lemon. It not taste lemony. It have a lemony. Yeah. It's really it good. It reminds me of some kind of jewel plum. Something like Yeah. Sour. Like, a, something. like it, it has a, a soury, lemony taste. All mm. right. Some cactus are poisonous. Yes, Giovanni. That's true. That is true. Some cactus are poisonous. So you have to find the one that is not palace. Lashan, I tell you the truth. It's super duper slimy though. The slime, the slime comes at you, don't it, baby? Mm -hmm. But it's it not is, unbearable for me though. It, <laughs> you're just trouble. I am in class. Mm -hmm. But it it's not unbearable. And I by the way, by the way, now that now that I've tried it, I am gonna be oh Lord, I'm gonna make a salad. Woo hoo hoo hoo! I'm gonna try this as a salad. Anyway, leave this alone. One more taste. I will juice cactus with pineapple and ginger before I eat it. <laughs> it tastes good, guys. Honestly. 
I love, I love the tang in it. Lashan, Jesus, peace, Lashan. <laughs> oh, Jocelyn said, oh my God, that's what you're making. I'm Puerto Rican. I'm excited. Nopal is so good. See, Lashan says, put some tagine. Mm, the tagine boss, queen. You know, tagine queen. <laughs> All right, so let's get back to the get back. All right. So what we have now, we have our Nepalis here. All right. Okay. And what many people do is to eliminate the salt, they boil it. So we're going to boil ours. Now, I'm, I have some saltfish here, our salted cod, that we did also boil to remove and eliminate the excess um, sodium or salt. And this was boiled for how long? About 20, 20, 30 minutes? Come on. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> 30 minutes. <laughs> 30 minutes. I boiled it twice, which is important because the initial boiling is not going to get out all the salt. So you change the water and boil it a second. So this is how we take the dish now and we put it in a Jamaican context. Everything Jamaican make with salt fish taste good. start over. Oh, <laughs> There's no more ingredients to start over. You missed the whole thing. You Simone, watch you have to go watch it again yeah, from the yeah, scratch. Yeah, watch it. So this is how we Jamaicanize the dish now because we are going to turn it in a Jamaican food. You understand? Even though it's Latin American food. Mm -hmm. All right. Let me show you what else I have. I have um, onions. Mm -hmm. I have tomatoes. I have thyme. Jamaican uh, use a lot of thyme. We have some uh, cilantro here. We have garlic. And we have scallion. And so we're going to chop these up right quick. And then we're going to get the dish a rolling. All right. So, babes, you want to show them the Nepalis that is already in the, in the pot? Because in the interest of time, we... Dominical says, not many Mexicans know about salt fish from, for some reason. They do it as a salad here. I'm and... from Haiti. And okay. I want a Caribbean style. Thank you for the help. Wow, um, and and many Mexicans call saltfish bacalao, mm -hmm. wow. so they make they use it a lot, but they just cook it differently. Mm -hmm. So the bacalao is, is 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 they use it they use it in Mexico. What am I showing? The the, the Nepal is in the pot. All right, you guys. So this is how it looks. It has been boiling for maybe 20, 25 minutes or so. Mm -hmm. Right. Let me try though. Yeah, so it immediately changes color once it hits the water. So it's no longer that bright green color. And that's the only downside. Yeah, mm -hmm. more of a faded olive green type color. Yeah, so this is how it looks. And this helps to take out the sliminess from it. The boiling process helps to take out the, the sliminess. So yay. And over here we have our supporting yes. cast. <laughs> This is the star. This is the supporting. Uh, the, the, yeah. This is the um extras. <laughs> mm -hmm. So we have dumpling, yam, banana, and maybe potato. It's a lot of food, but yeah. Jamaicans call it ground provision. Ground provision. And Ram, good morning to you. Good morning, good morning. Let's go back over here. This yeah, is the Yardy lifestyle, you guys. Yardy lifestyle. And we want to thank those persons who have who purchased their t-shirts from yeah. Yardy Belly TV. I appreciate you guys. Please take a picture and in your shirt and send it to me so I can post it if you are okay with that. Um, so we can big you up. You know what I mean? So please, thank you so much, guys. If you want your Yardy Belly t-shirt or your Jamaican t-shirt, we're having our independence coming up in a couple months. You want to get your shirt to represent, yeah? Mm -hmm. I remember tell you when me like my shirt. When me when me wear my shirt, I say police. Me love wear my shirt when I say police. Because most American police, when them know say you come from Jamaica, them love you. Because, mm -hmm. you know, some of them smoke weed. So, but between me and me, I really talk that loud. You know, and then some of them love jerk chicken. Some of them love reggae music. So when you talk, when you're Jamaican, it just brings out that, that little... You know, wild side. They know the police pull you over and say, um, license and registration. I say, what one officer? And they're like, where are you from? 
And I said Jamaica, and he's like, oh, Man, Jamaica. I was in Montego Bay three <laughs> years ago, and such a beautiful place. So, argument done. <laughs> okay, man, just drive safely, okay? Just take care of yourself, man. Just don't, <laughs> don't, don't be driving too hard. I'm sorry, respect officer, bless up. <laughs> Try said just once, just what you said about the cactus leads me to believe it would make a great pie. Lemon and cap cactus pie. Try next episode. Listen to your manager. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> the only thing try is that if you try to blend it, then you're gonna be in inundated with slime. Um and if you boil it, you may very well I, I you might can boil it and then mince it, maybe. Mm -hmm. You know? But yeah, those are some of the concerns because it really is slimy. Alright? And Ram said, I think YouTube is not sending notification for your channel because you should have hundreds watching now. I should, don't it, Enram? Yeah, it depends on who signed up for notification too. Yeah. Right, well, I don't know, man. We're struggling with that. Kim Kim, good morning. Good morning to you too. New York in the house. Hey. Kim Kim is in the house. Hey, hey baby, 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 come, come on, on, baby, baby, come on. Love wifey t-shirt. <laughs> My t-shirt, yeah, let me show you guys my t-shirt. I don't know if it's going to show you the writing in the right direction. Will it? it is, it does. It oh, is. don't look at the wrong. Don't show them Sorry. the wrong. Don't show them the wrong. Oops, oh, don't oops, show them oops, the wrong. Oops, oops. I'm trying to... Uh, <laughs> yeah, are you guys seeing it the right way? Yeah, they are. This one said, Tonya Han make fashion. And then it gives you the definition of what that means. Use what's available to make something good if you're not wearing if this is not in your drawer or your closet what you doing with your life <laughs> get your life you guys <laughs> you guys know well, you're to take your door. <laughs> <laughs> the girl said get your life if you're in your closet <laughs> wow it was some bad me now because i i be i be you know coming she for his coming people hard on my people <laughs> You know, if you don't, if you don't hit the like button, then you're a loser. Kim Kim says she's in Connecticut, not New York. Kim Kim, Connecticut is in the house. Hey, Springfield is in the house. Hey, Our Bridgeport. Hey, baby, baby, come on. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Giovanni so. said, if you can take the slime off okra, then you yes. surely take the slime content off. And that's the so. thing I wanted to, I wanted to point this out, guys, because the truth is. For us as Jamaicans who eat steam fish and okra, this is not overly slimy. As a matter of fact, if you chop up this and put it on some steam fish right now, you, we would love it. Mm -hmm. You know, and the difference with it and the okra is that it also adds a, a, a lemony. I, I really get that flavor mm -hmm. note. A nice lemony flavor like you're, like you're doing lemon pepper. Mm -hmm. So I think it would be, uh, you know what, Giovanni? Stop, Giovanni. I need to go check. Let me check what's the name of, um, what is it called? Cactus. Cause... No palace. Giovanni, let me tell you what you do right now. My head, <laughs> my head a mash up. I need to make some of this <laughs> in some real good food. Oh, yes. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Just me, I'm so excited about trying this because it really. Benefits of cactus. It really, 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 really Here's tastes a summary good. From Helpline. Nopal cactus benefits and uses. Antiviral protects nerve cells. Gains antioxidants. Regulates blood sugar levels. Treats enlarged prostate. Reduces cholesterol. Eliminates hangovers. Forms and doses. And more. So who said they weren't gonna try this now? Hmm. Guys, this have a wealth of health benefits. Trust me. Have to try it. Trust me. Debbie L. Debbie Day can say how much is the shirt. Well, the shirts, the prices are Varies. varied. The prices are varied. So you would have to go Based and check, design. you know, whatever design you like and the size and all these things. And then you will see the price. But the shop link for the shirts is right there, right below. Yeah, just click the shop now. Yeah, there's a shop now link right and it's on in the, the channel. Box as well. Yeah. Debbie, 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 Debbie. Wasn't there another Debbie? Debbie L. Debbie L. Good morning to you. Good morning to you. I never eat that before. Wow. <laughs> For real, we have we you and us both. We haven't eaten it before either, though. GCB would arm twisted getting some today. 
<laughs> Your arm twist quick. <laughs> Oh my god, Maria right. Reed, good morning to you from Alaska. Alaska, Alaska is, is in, in the house. house. Hey. Um, Anchorage. Anchorage. Anchorage is in, in the house. house. Hey. 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 Baby, 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 come on. Baby, baby, come on. Baby, baby, come on. <laughs> Here is our Nepalis right there. Show them the fit that that. Stop showing yourself now. I'm showing you. Hey. Yeah, so. Guys, summer shirt. Like summer shirt. Tonya oh, Han make yeah. fashion. Oh, we're wearing the same shirt. Yeah, we I are. I didn't even realize. Yeah, that's why we look so cute. Let me say I'm a foot up. Guys, why when people are taking picture? I know, where, <laughs> why when people are taking picture, them lift up one foot? Selfie time. Try to go on cute. All right, enough of that. Enough of that. <laughs> Enough, enough. <laughs> Why? All right, full time. All right, guys. Our kitchen is super duper small, guys. So we have a whole lot of stuff strewn, strewn everywhere in the kitchen. So bear with us. If you see anything that you don't like, just bear with us. Um, yeah. But I, I was telling him yesterday that we are going to be having our comfortable kitchen very soon. I just see it. I believe it. I feel it. Hallelujah. With our nice countertop and, and the island. Oh, island man. and space. We can go any angle we want to. Hallelujah. I feel Trust it, child. Me. I feel it. Oh, hot color loo Trust burns dog. Yeah, yeah. Hallelujah. Anchorage is in the house. Big up yourself. Oh. <laughs> Mince the cactus, drain, and then mix it with lemon and ginger. That's how you make the pie. Okay. You're, you're the one try of what I can make it already. Good morning from San Antonio, Texas. Texas in, in the, the house. house. Hey. San Antonio is in the house. Whoa. Hey, baby, 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 come on. No, baby, I like baby. I like these places that are logging I on this morning know. because they they are places that this cactus grows, man. It thrives in the deserty type of area, and so I love that. All right, guys. So what we have here is the cactus with a little bit of onion. I, I let me tell you what I did. I put garlic and onion with the cactus mm -hmm. and I boil it down. I'm going to I'm going to cut these up. So I'm just taking them out because I'm going to cut them up finer. Mm -hmm. I'm, I, I don't waste nothing, no, guys. Babe, I know you're busy, but we have to pause for this cause. Oh, what? What's the cause? Coffee come in like a rapture. Hey. And everybody get capture. Hey. 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 <laughs> you see, she now have no baby. Stop, no. <laughs> she have Shut no baby. Up. Stop. <laughs> Good morning to Coffee's Kitchen. <laughs> All right, food. All right. We're getting there. We're getting there. Let me, um, let me take a breather. I'm trying to keep up with these. Believe and you will receive. Thank you, Marie. Thank you so much. You guys just believe with us. Need it. We need it. We need it. Um, in Texas, we eat cactus. It's actually very delicious. So, okay, Julio. Bless um, up to you, Julio. Bless Shia Hampton. Good morning from El Paso, Texas. See? El Paso is in, in the, the house. house. Hey, Texas, Texas in the house. Guys, hey. mine and no, mine and no, make me have forgot for my, my cowboy hat. <laughs> so far, <laughs> Texas is winning right now, right? Yes, Texas is winning yes, right now. Are. Not lying to no. All right, so come. Let's let's get over to the store. Yarny belly, can you also execute a smoothie with cactus? Giovanni is asking. I would I would definitely try, but it has to. Be, yeah, I would try. Yeah. I would try, because it has that fruity vibe. It could work. Yeah. And I'm especially more... from the fact that it's good for for um diabetes and all those things, I would definitely try. Tanya, good morning to you. Michelle J says she was just talking to her family about cactus. Tennessee in the Tennessee is in the house. Hey. Where? Um, um, yeah. <laughs> Tennessee City. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Wait. Used to, I know, I know somewhere in Tennessee, you know, I see it in Monopoly where we play Monopoly. <laughs> I don't know. All right. Let's, let's, let's get to, let's get to getting. Yeah. All right. Get yeah. over here, baby, with the camera. Camera time. And what I'm doing is I'm, I'm going to quickly boil this, but I'm not going to overboil it. As a matter of fact, I'm going to lock it off now. This That's is the one? one that I cut up okay. already, but you know, I, I, because I thought... But now, I, now that I know and I like how it tastes, it tastes mm -hmm. I'm not going to overboil it. 
All right, guys. So I have my salted cod here, and I'm gonna dump it in the pot. Um. <laughs> Cactus bully beef tacos. <laughs> that should be good enough. Yeah, it would be. I'm gonna put my my garlic. Garlic, you guys. And I did I tell you I put some coconut oil mm. in the pot. So I put about maybe three tablespoons of coconut oil in the pot. Mm. Smells good. And then I'm gonna also add my tomatoes. Do you like the size of the sausage? Yeah, it's good, it's good, it's good, it's comfortable. Back in the day, we used to shred out the sawfish. Well, me, I used to break up the sawfish very fine, but no, we didn't. Yeah, back in the day, we was a kid, but not anymore. <laughs> Kappa, <sorry. laughs> well, no. no. <laughs> Why are you always bringing by these old songs to me? <laughs> Lissy, Big Mama, I am upset now. I want to see how you sorry, prepare babe. it prior to being... It being on the table. What Wait, did you can you watch do? the video. You can watch the, the video. Step by step. Oh yeah, yeah. You have to watch, rewatch the video. That's the thing with it's, live videos. We always leave them up. Yeah. You know, so you can always. I go have back. a breakfast live playlist that you can check out the playlist, and you will find all my other breakfast, Caribbean inspired breakfast, um, Asian inspired breakfast, wherever we mm. go, vegan breakfast. We have a lot of vegan food too, guys, and this cactus would be perfect as a vegan dish. Mm -hmm. Are you serious that there is somebody else from Texas? Deb Elaine, Chip, <laughs> Texas? No, you Texas. <laughs> what what's up with more Texas people? This because morning? we put cactus, that's why. Okay. They, they know about the, the cactus. <laughs> okay, welcome Deb Elaine. Thank you guys for joining us. Yada Belly TV is a Jamaican channel where Jamaican people and we we're, we're not chefs. We have international taste. Though. So <laughs> we cook we're Jamaica. Not chef, yeah, we're, we're not chef. We are. He's a amazing. He's a chef in my book. I don't care what anybody else say or what he says. He is an amazing chef. Or if I am, I'm intuitively taught. Yeah. Taught. He's not professionally trained, but he is intuitively genius. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So I'm gonna add the Nepali snow. Hmm. No palace in that. And I'm, let me just take this off because I'm going to add this okay. to it as well. Oh, okay. You can actually and pick it. Oh, wow. I'm just draining it. Look, show, show this over here. Sorry mm -hmm. for how dark over here is. Mm -hmm. I just drain it off, guys. Oh, okay. In my strainer. Yeah. And, and then, then I rinse it off. Oh. So sorry about the dark aspect of the kitchen. Bear with yeah. us. It's not that perfect anyway, so I really don't want you to see everything, you know? <laughs> and then we just bring it over here Can't and add, add it. it. Yeah, somebody was giving an excellent suggestion. She was saying you can actually pickle it. Here in Arizona, you put it on top of hot dogs like relish. Oh, wow. Nice. Oh, wow. That sounds so good. So there, look at that. Mm -hmm. Look at that, guys. <laughs> nice. Nopalis and salt fish, salted cod. Jamaicans say salt fish. Uh, Latin Americans, uh, Latin people say uh, bacalao. Mm -hmm. Americans say salted cod. Mm -hmm. And then you have some thyme. Yeah. You just pull on the thyme and it releases the little leaves. <laughs> Rosemary Dam says, just realized I'm drinking my coffee. <laughs> from a cactus mug i think i think this is what i think and i know it will happen in the future because it's just how technology works i think their game so that people who are on live can share pictures yeah in the chat yeah i think that would be pretty cool so we could see your mug um julia said we love food. adding some butter <laughs> I like butter because butter adds a glass finish to it. <laughs> Lisa said, never mind, it's the food you want, not the kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's coming, it's coming, guys, it's coming. Aww, coffee said, you made my morning. Was feeling a little bored this morning, always giving me something interesting to watch. Thank you so much, Coffee. And guys, if you are on, go ahead and give him a thumbs up for stepping outside of the box please we would appreciate it 
and sometimes we take it for granted but these little things the comments the thumbs up every interaction with the channel helps you know with growing the channel and yeah. you know and motivating us as well motivating us as well so we're doing it for the we're not doing it for the likes but yeah <laughs> the likes do help so we do it for the love we're not doing it for the likes hey. do it for the love we're not doing it for the likes hey. success never come overnight hey. <laughs> You, you, you guys it. realize with music, I'm right on the edge, you know. If you, you, you push me back over, when it comes to music, I am Garlic. right on the edge. <laughs> that and a little well, I don't think I need this. Um. <laughs> that part got me singing my Fisparo selfish tune. <laughs> <laughs> it's sweeter than meat. <laughs> When you go to eat, <laughs> ah, salt fish sweet. Yes, sister, me did, me did I did mean, I was there too. I was there too. Don't worry about it. I was there. I'm putting a little paprika. This is where your pot start get nice now, guys. Cause mm -hmm. you have to season up your pot. Uh, no, just regular. a regular. Okay. All right. I'm adding some paprika. I'm adding a, a little old bay. Hold on there. I need to put a little water in this pot. Sensible crime. Hi, sensible crime. I don't remember seeing you before. Thank you for joining us. Yeah, thank you. She said, love you both. Oh, Thanks. You, oh you know, says that she. Oh, sorry. <laughs> There's a picture that I can't see well, but I don't know. Let, let us know. <laughs> it says, they say, they love for the many good plant based recipes. Thank you so much. And guys, remember to check out my vegan playlist. I'm adding some Old Bay, and Old Bay is one of those seasoning that is almost like a complete seasoning, guys. We love to use Old it, Bay. Yeah, sure uh, especially when we're using fish, fish-based fish dish. Mm -hmm. It's super, super delicious. It's a, I think it's a Louisiana um, yeah. Yeah, special, it's good with crabs and seafood like that. Mm -hmm. And of course, our go-to is our garlic powder. We have to have garlic powder. Can I open it? Yeah. <laughs> it's dark. Maybe it's the phone not on okay. All right, let me let me grab this. All right, so I'm just folding in all of this now. Mm -hmm. And there's something that I have to add to this recipe this morning. Anybody can guess what it is? Because <laughs> I'm thinking something, but I, I'm not sure if that's where he's going. I have to have to add it this morning. I truly hope it's what I'm thinking. <laughs> I don't. No, it's not ketchup. <laughs> not ketchup. <laughs> ah, I was thinking. I was hoping it was ketchup. Because ketchup makes everything better for me. <laughs> oh, somebody got it. Somebody said ketchup. <laughs> no, Ben Charles said Scotch bonnet. Ben. 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 The two of us need look no more. <laughs> we both found what we were looking for. With the scotch bonnet to add. The saltfish gonna be glad. And we will see the food. It is so nice to eat. Diva forever. What are you saying? I like what you're doing. But because I'm a person of color, I would... A can of chopped tomato? Are you saying you would use a can of chopped yes, tomato? Yes, yes, yes. Okay. But isn't it... But I use fresh tomatoes. This so. is the same. Um, This is tomato, chopped tomato, but it's just not yeah, from the can. Yeah, fresh. Mm -hmm. So I added my my, salt, my scotch bonnet pepper. And then I have one more thing that I have to add. And this is taking it back to the Hispanic roots. Mm -hmm. This Ooh, is nice. my pimento seasoning, guys. I don't know who came up with this seasoning, but it is the bomb. The pimento seasoning is awesome. If you love pepper flavor, but you can't manage the heat, find this seasoning anywhere it Let is. Let me show them again. Pimento seasoning, guys. Yeah, I love it. Troy said he cooks from the soul. He's a soul cooker. It's a gift from the Almighty. True. Almighty. I agree. Yeah. Simone Kelly said tagine. <laughs> <laughs> no Simone. <laughs> and then we are gonna finish up with our green onions. Mm -hmm. Everybody got scotch bonnet. In Africa we call it pili. Pili pili. 
Pili Pili. Oh, for real. Pili Pili. Baltimore. Baltimore is in the house. Hey, Maryland. Maryland's in the house. Hey, hey baby, baby, come on. Baby, baby, come on. Hi, Charlene. Good morning. Good morning. No black pepper? That's yeah, what I'm asking too, pepper. baby. Black That's pepper. what I'm asking too. Well, I'm gonna put the black pepper. Leave me alone, no? <laughs> Good morning, Kimberly Mensa. Good morning to you. All right, let me do some sous chef work while I do some camera work at the same time. <laughs> when you're not a big chef, you just have to hold your position. Cilantro, Ooh. chopped cilantro. That makes it Latin, also yeah. Latin inspired dish by adding cilantro, right? He's teaching me so much. He has taught me so much. If it wasn't for him, I would be eating <laughs> brown stew chicken and curry chicken every day. <laughs> black pepper and guys it's better <laughs> to have the black pepper in the grinder but unfortunately we are not there yet so we'll soon get there keep mm -hmm. buying shirts from us and and, and supporting us mm -hmm. and we will get there eventually yes and let me just stir it like so and when i like what i like about when i'm cooking guys is i try not to make like the tomato cook out too much i wanted some of the stuff to be continue being fresh and nice this is good. Ready to turn off this now. Any other suggestions? You want the, the ketchup in it still? If five people say ketchup must go in there, then I think we should put it. Nobody not. Anybody say thinks it. we should put ketchup in here? Let us know. Should Nobody we put ketchup? put ketchup? in here. I'm advocating for the ketchup. He's not really too feeling the ketchup for this dish, but anybody think we should put ketchup? A bit more water. I think it would give it a great. Hey, when you're eating boiled food, you know. You have to have a gravy vibe. All right. No so way. I didn't hear nobody say ketchup here. Nobody say ketchup. Lashawn said this is not bully beef. Wow. <laughs> um, <laughs> oh, she's the only one that answered though, so that don't even count. Lashawn, thank you so much, Lashawn. I know, Simone. Oh, I don't understand how we don't hear nothing from Barrington. Hmm. Barrington look like him slide it's out to the <laughs> slide out to the chat. <laughs> Oh yes, I enjoy the authenticity and true good vibes you give off. So two thumbs up plus two big corn toes up <laughs> plus one top lip. <laughs> oh Lord, you're right, a trip. All right. All right. All right, so Michelle says no ketchup. Thank you, Michelle. Joycelyn says no ketchup. Kimberly says no ketchup. Charles awesome. says no ketchup. Uh e. Mm -hmm. You hate none people them because they said no ketchup. Ha <coughs> ha! <coughs> yeah, I don't know. Other people them said no, no, and no. No. All right. For the tea. I guess. I <coughs> guess. <laughs> oh no, win. You are so like a sore loser, babes. You all win. <coughs> Lime or lemon? Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna squeeze a lemon. Okay. But on the finish. Okay. This looks really interesting, though. All right, babes, you need to get over here. All right, guys, so what we have now is the full hundred finish dish. See, turn off the stove. Now, let me show you a little bit of, you know, I don't know if other cultures do this, but because we have to purchase these things so often, we just use, um, foil paper you know so if you see it just act blind towards it but the stove is off and this is just going to be allowed to you know sort of come down to room temperature and then i'm going to be plating the dish right now okay so this is this is my bacalao and nopalis or saltfish with tuna cactus or cactus with salted cod all right you need to get the full flavor. Yes, yes, sir. Yes, yes, yes. Um, let's yes, Lashan. <laughs> no, Lashan. I promise you, it is. It. Ugh, I can't. Let, I can't wait to mukbang this. Cannot wait to mukbang this. Yeah. So I want to just thank all of you guys for watching, and we want to encourage you also. Our program is about us. It's uh, really our our little expression of love, of, of friendship to the world. And we thank you guys for participating and joining us every week. And we want to encourage you. 
this time, at this time, the world is changing. Uh, many folks have not yet come to grips with that. Um, even myself, we have not yet come to grips with it, that the world is changing and things will never be the same. It, irrespective of how we want it, it will not be the same. And so we need to, you know, learn how to adjust ourselves and we need to also learn how to, um, you know, keep that level-headedness because anxieties are great at this time a lot of people anxious but i remember somewhere in the bible it says be anxious for nothing but in everything through prayer and supplication and i know there are many persons who may not be religious but if you can find something that to anchor your soul with and to make yourself uh to to, to bring console consolation to your soul you know use it the bible is what we use and it says be anxious for nothing but in everything, through prayer and supplication, let your request be made known to God. And God will deal with it. God will fix it. Uh, Michelle J., give me, give me a couple seconds. And so God is, God is awesome, and he is still in control. It may seem like he's not, but he is. And so I am encouraging you guys. I'm encouraging each and every one. Do your best to seek after God, especially during this time pray about everything we may be struggling with unemployment we may be struggling you know some people uh they're they're okay through all of this they're making money through all of this the opportunity has has been open for them to make a ton of money but for some they're losing a lot of money and for some they are they're even they've even lost family family members and friends and, and people close to them and so i'm just saying find ways to encourage your soul find ways to keep your sanity find ways to you know um, um um bring a sense of normalcy to your home or to your household to your life for me being on youtube is the most normal thing that i can do because everything else seems to be crashing down on on top of us we are not working you know um we are we are we are in this small space you know we don't know what the future holds it's a whole bunch of stuff but we are happy being that we are in God, being that we know all things work together for good to those who love God and who are called according to his purpose. We know these things and we have chosen to believe these things. And in our belief, it's where we find strength. And so what I'm saying to you, again, if you're not a Christian person, if you're not religious, find that source of strength that you can stand on, a premise, a platform, a pedestal that you can stand on, that you can face the world and, and, and the onslaught and everything that's coming at you. Turn off the TV some of the times. Guys, I've never realized how much distraction the TV brings. Turn the TV off, go outside, sit on the stoop or go in the backyard. Do Find some place that you can just go commune with nature because nature outside the, the 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 plants the trees the great nullifier it's it, it nullifies everything and um i just want to encourage you guys all over the world we have viewers all over the world and for that we are grateful you know our channel is small we are not chefs we are, we don't we don't talk standard english all the time we just do what we do all right <laughs> uh diva is still on the ketchup she said ketchup don't make everything taste good uh-huh so boy <laughs> And then, the, all right, I, I'm done with this preaching. Um, somebody else had asked me to show them the, the pimento. It is called Mal's Original Paramin Pimento Seasoning. All right, and this is just one brand, guys. Um, I, you know, um, I think it's a generic brand. So if you see it, it, it might not be in every single shelf, on every single shelf. But this one is super good. Let me tell you what I love about this one. It has a very strong scotch bonnety flavor. It smells like hot pepper, but it doesn't have any heat at all. So I, I believe they use the seasoning pepper. And um, it is super duper good. And I think it's from Trinidad. Yep, it was made in Trinidad. So this is a Trini seasoning. Big up on my Trini. Big up all y'all. My, my Trini people, big up. Yes, this one. Is from Trini. It's very good. It use it use it on your doubles and your triples. <laughs> <laughs> so 
this one is from Trinidad. So guys, if you're looking for pimento seasoning, search for the one that is Trinidad based and you will most likely get that. I'm sorry if you're not getting the focus, um, you know, but this is super duper good. All right. No heat at all, Barbie. But it is, it is, um, it is no heat, but it is very, very spicy in flavor. It, I, I can't explain it. It's super duper flavorful. It yeah, it has a super strong peppery flavor, but no pepper. It's not hot at all. You can, I could take it, I could chug it from the from the cap. So it's it's a very very really good um, um, dish. All right, so that's number one. Um, all right, so the wifey has to talk to you guys right now. Um, get over, baby. Come, baby. We're waiting on you. Waiting on you before we do the big reveal. The big reveal. This food, it, I can't, guys, you want to see my plate? Oh my lord. <laughs> All right, guys. So, this video, Breakfast Live, is brought to you by none other than One True Natural. Yeah. And One True Natural, you guys, you might have already heard of it. If you haven't heard about One True Natural, let me introduce you. It's a natural hair product line it's my natural hair product line actually and these are the three products that we have so far we have first of all our shine of mine one true natural shine of mine nourishing oil blend is a blend of organic oils that are awesome for the scalp it's amazing to add shine it locks in the moisture you can use it as a hot oil treatment and it's also amazing for your skin so yeah and we also have the Jamaican black castor oil and this proudly comes straight from the farms in Jamaica St. Mary yes mm. straight from the farm to our shelf and it is amazing nothing else added no other oils no other preservatives nothing that's the authentic nutty Jamaican genuineness oil. of yeah this castor oil this this can be ingested right you know and it's awesome for cleansing the body if you have issues in that sense and then you can we take a teaspoon of it mm -hmm. and we have our one true natural castor oil mascara and this is a lash and brow growth and thickening um treatment it has a wand like a typical mascara and it like i said thickens and grows the brows and the lashes and yeah, you guys. Let me show now. Let me show now. Look for my lash. Show them my lash. You see it? Oh, it thick. Watch That's it. your brow though. Oh, my brow. <laughs> <For> my lash. <laughs> and you guys, because we have Mother's Day fast approaching, we have gone ahead and we have gift sets available for sale. You don't want to be typical. You don't want your, your mother to be able to, to um, predetermine what she's going to get like everybody. Oh, I'm going to get a cologne. I'm gonna get some flowers. Yeah. I'm gonna get an earring. You know, be different. Or I'm you gonna guys. get I'm gonna get the appliance. Yeah. I mean, all our moms should be natural. Most of our moms, and even if they're not natural, this these products are natural, but they're not only for naturals. They can be used in any hair type. So these are our gift sets that you can order. Yes. And you will get all three products in the set. Yeah. So yeah, that that works. We need a gift set for my wife. <laughs> gift sets, you guys, for the mother in your life. And you can go ahead and order if you order. Oh, and I'm going to just throw in one of these for, for, for them. Just so that they need their downtime where nobody bothers them. They can just go all offline. Yeah. So that's just a free gift being thrown in. So you can order on Etsy.com slash shop. It's gonna be in the one description true box. natural. That's etsy.com slash shop slash one true natural. The link will be in the description box mm -hmm. of this video. Or you can go to one true natural on Instagram and the shop link is right there that you can just click it. It's just a fingertip away. Click shop and enjoy and show the mother or the special woman in your life. It doesn't have to be your biological mother. Any woman who is a mother to you or a mother to anybody else deserves to be, you know, shown love on that special day. So, yeah, without further ado, the food, you guys. <laughs> 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 All right, so 
Can you move them things out of my turnstile, please? Thank you very much. Ta ta da ta 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 we have white yam. We have banana. And the star of the show, Nopalis and Saltfish. Woo! <laughs> Grab your phone, see? <laughs> yeah, man. Look there, guys. Look there. 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 Annie Skin, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Mm, look pan wa gwa no. <laughs> Grizzling say <sir>, peng food. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah man, watch it. Cactus and saltfish. Look at it. Mm? Oh my god, I'm drooling. Jamaican dumpling boiled. <laughs> oh lord. Yeah. Trust me guys, may I tell you the truth. Yeah. You had the belly TV. And remember, you can follow me on Instagram. See, me, see you notice my put my lemon. You notice my lemon mm -hmm. wedge. Mm -hmm. eh? It's so very wedgeous. Mm -hmm. It's a very wedgeous lemon. Mm -hmm. Big up yourself, Grizzling. Mem, I'm gonna tell you. We are work on it. We are work on it. Guys, we are try. It look nice. <laughs> Cute, Josh. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> That's no. the cue for class today. Remember okay. me tell you, Lashawn, the class, I go over almost immediately now. Debbie Dakers, good morning to you. Yeah, man, so guys, it, it is a way in which we can... <laughs> Tanya, Tanya said, so wedge us lemon. It's a way in which we can utilize those items that we may not necessarily use all the time. This is Nopalis, otherwise known as tuna cactus in Jamaica. And it is paired here with, with a Jamaican classic, saltfish. You can have it as a, as a very, very healthy, delicious salad. You can uh, maybe juice it in some smoothies. You can, you know, cook it down like I did here. And you can have it with pork. You can have it with chicken. As a matter of fact, I'm going to beat up some with some curry chicken. I'm going to make this dish one of the main source of, of protein that my, me and my family going to have. And as I said, it's super duper good for diabe diabetics you know it lowers blood sugar it is an excellent source of good nutrition it lowers cholesterol lowers cholesterol and it's yeah good for the prostate it's good for the oh lord i got to drink eat more of that because the prostate is it needed you know all these <laughs> things you understand <laughs> um try some mine is good for belly rubbing <laughs> And so, guys, we thank you once again for joining us today. We're going to have the wifey try this. Um, no, 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 no. Come on, babes. You know you have to try it. You have to try this. See. You, you can't make this go on. So, need to see y'all face when eating. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> so, Chola Sean, stop the man. Not tell me, say, peace till no know. His eyelash me. from eyebrow. <laughs> wow. They're coming for me this morning. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, I'm gonna grab a, a little plate because I want to save the thumbnail plate. I know. Thumbnail plates need to be um, preserved. Read the comments, babes. Um, um, um. <laughs> Will you stop? Wait, no, I'm trying to see. Is the eye patch for the guys or the ladies? Um, this shutdown has really put a damper on the beauty shops. The eye patch. The eye patch. About the, the, the eye patch is for the 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 mother. It's a part <laughs> of her gift set. So yeah, for her to relax. If she, if she, for for her to block you guys out when you <laughs> get annoying to her. <laughs> wow, yeah. that's, that's hurtful. <laughs> I will look for it on my supermarket shelf, maybe in the international aisle. I do not live in the USA. Okay, diva. And as I said, it, it, it's from Trinidad. So it, it, and, and they're talking about the, the um, pimento seed. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. 
what kind of oil is shine of mine shine of mine is a blend of a variety of oils it's it's a it's a nice combination of lighter and heavier oils giving it the perfect um weight it's not too heavy not too light but it's definitely a combination of oils yeah what else did i only add ketchup if you add lemon and crush red peppers <laughs> you add crushed red peppers but no heat in it yeah we put country pepper in there man your Trinidadian accent is good, not bad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my god, god. I'm buying my two bottles of shine of mine today. Hold on, see, hold on, see, guys. For your viewing pleasure, <laughs> class <and> done. <laughs> Joshua, class is over. I'm glad to you come. <laughs> it, this, you gotta try this, Josh. I'm glad to you come. Mm -hmm. Now that you're here, you can be the taste tester. And I'll, I'll tell you what it is after you after you try it. <laughs> All right. So CB would say, what's up, Josh? <laughs> so Joshua is going to be the official taste tester. Let us know how oh, it tastes. Eat the green thing. Eat the green thing, too. You like it? It's it's sour, like 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 um like lemon, right? Like right, like citrusy. But it's good, guys. We we'll get a pass from Joshua. We we'll just get a pass from Joshua. So, babes, this is your turn now. And and see, Joshua's class. I I just really have to call Joshua teacher because me can't understand. Oh, as soon as class over. So dear, here's the wife, you know. Wife is gonna give us a, a, a more verbatim description. <laughs> Joshua. See, me never send you for broke up um, banana, you know. Sorry. But see ya. <laughs> How is it? <laughs> Alright, let me taste it by itself. It has a tongue. Mm-hmm. It has a nice tongue and it got perfect with the salt fish because the saltiness and mm -hmm. the little sourness. Mm -hmm. I think it's a perfect combination. Do you think I should have added or anything like that to, to offset the tongue? Ketchup. <laughs> <laughs> no, I can't believe her. Guys, this is what we have to deal with now. This house, yeah. <laughs> Ketchup. <laughs> yeah, let me chat with something. <laughs> it's nice, don't no? I'm not for trying. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Guys. Your turn. So, you always are drawing me out, you know. Mm -hmm. I know, say, I'm supposed to not be the taste tester in this regard. All right. So I'm gonna try the no palace by itself. Mm -hmm. And of course it's meant to be eaten in combination with other things, but I'm gonna try it by itself. Mm -hmm. Okay. It tastes just as it tastes when it was raw, minus the, the, the slime. Mm -hmm. So it has a very lemony citrusy type of vibe going mm -hmm. no type of bitterness no bitterness at all i think that's a misconception that mm -hmm. even i had that it was bitter it's not at all bitter and it pairs very well with the saltfish with you mm -hmm. and she's right if i had if i had added a ket a, a little ketchup it would have sort of mellow it out a little bit more so <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. but <laughs> And that dish, mm -hmm. it's not like nothing. Nothing. It stands very, very, lash on. I have to cook this for now. May I tell you the truth? <laughs> I have to go cook this for now. I'm sorry for Sister Smith, um, no palace tree. I know, right? Because I go over there and read it. Every morning, I squeeze and go, and go pick them off. Somebody say, I'll catch up to your plate and see how it tastes. I'd catch up to my it have to get cooked in. I mean, mm -hmm. I don't want the raw ketchup vibe. Mm -hmm. It would have had to, you, you know, mellow you know, into the dish to... It won't be the same. Mm -hmm. 
you don't miss nothing without the ketchup. Mm -hmm. Ketchup would have blend it nice, but it don't miss. And I like I say, oh my God, it needs ketchup. No. Mm -hmm. mm. Tastes so good. <laughs> see there? For those who never know what it is, see there? Mm -hmm. No palace. This is it. Tuna. That's what we're eating this morning. Mm -hmm. Alright? And I actually picked this to put on the back of my head because I have bumps on the back of my neck mm -hmm. and, and dark spots. And so I picked this to put on the back of my neck. And I've been doing that for the past couple of months and it's been working. Um, and then I started research on this about the neck. Mm -hmm. And I said, hold on, but... They am I eat it? <laughs> and I said, if it work outside, you can imagine how it work inside. Mm -hmm. So... That's that's our no palace and saltish and I mean if you don't want to stay on the can stay but for me <laughs> I'm working. <laughs> she sound like my son who say him allergic to tomatoes but drink a bottle of ketchup. <laughs> <laughs> you know what Joshua and the avocado. Mm -hmm, Joshua allergic to avocado. He don't eat avocado but he loves guacamole. <laughs> I don't understand how that works. <laughs> Paula, you missed it all. Yeah, you have to watch from the scratch, from the, the beginning. When Once it's done, you can just watch the whole thing. Because you have to see how we turn this into this. Yeah. Back into that. You got to watch. That's a nice thing, a nice post for your, for, your, um, for your Instagram, for the Instagram. Okay. So? Do it now. See, I'm not doing it. The time done? Somebody is requesting that you pray for Jamaica. For our Jamaicans struggling through this period, help me pray for us. Let me pray for us. Thank you. God bless. You. In a minute, let us pray. Let us pray. Let us pray. We not for itch from prayer. No itching from prayer. So make we pray. And if you are not religious, as I said, please bear with us during this exercise. This is who we are. This is what we are about. Heavenly Father, we thank you, Lord, for mercy and grace every day. We thank you, Lord God, that in the midst of this crisis, you are still in control. And Lord, if we would just take a breather to hear what you have to say to us, if we would just calm down and stop being so selfish and full of self, we would hear what you have to say to us, what you're trying to speak to your people, to the people of the earth right now. Father, we know this is not a, it's not limited to one place. It's not a Jamaican situation or, or a virus. It is not a religious virus. It's not a Christian virus or a Muslim virus. It's, it's against humanity. And however it has come, however it has been, if it's created or it has developed, Lord God, you use these things sometimes, Lord, to pull us to a place where we seek after you and search within ourselves to say, what am I doing? Get to, just, just to, to, to pull ourselves up. So, Father, we pray that we would be wise during this time. We would seek your face during this time. We would exercise cautiousness during this time, Lord God. We pray for Jamaica as an island, the people there, the government. We pray, Lord God, for the, 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 the livelihood of those who are struggling, Lord God. We pray for those who may have lost in um, loved one. We pray, Lord God, for those who have, have um, been contaminated by this, this um, disease. And we pray, Lord, that you'll have mercy. We know we have done wrong. We know we have sought our way and not your way. But, Lord, we pray that you in your long suffering would be merciful to us. We pray, Lord God, that we would not allow this thing to happen and we come out of it unscathed or not changing or not seeking to a, a different you know, walk or a different way of life. Father, there are those who are struggling real hard. Economically, they are struggling. Lord, there's people who don't have jobs and nowhere to live. And we pray, Lord God, that in your mercy, Lord God, you would provide for them. You are Jehovah Jireh after all. Father, we pray for those who have lost loved ones, Lord God. We know that the Jamaican community in New York has struggled, has been impacted greatly by this, is, this disease. We know that the Jamaican, com the Jamaican community in St. Catherine has been impacted by this uh, disease, this virus. We pray, Lord God, that we would not conduct business as usual. 
for those who don't know God and don't want to know God, they are using this opportunity to even more so, Lord God, gnash their teeth against you and to, to draw themselves even deeper into ungodliness. We pray that we would not allow that to happen to us. But we would seek you before it's late. This may be the last call before the end of days. We know that there are plans in place now, Lord God, that ushers in prophecies that have been foretold from the beginning of time about the end of time. We see it happening, Lord God. We see the, the things that you wrote about in the book happening. And so let us not be fooled, Lord God. Your word says, be careful how you live. Not as a fool, but as a wise person. Making use of every opportunity because the days are evil. And we are living in evil days. Even in the midst of this crisis, there are people still committing murders. There are people still trying to rob each other. There are people still looking to inflict a harm on one another. So we know we are living in evil days. There are conspiracies, there are uh, uh, pandemic and epidemic, and there is wars and rumors of wars. But Lord, we know that in you we will find refuge. Your word says, he who dwells in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. May we seek your secret place, Lord God. May we seek after you. So I pray a blessing on every person that is watching now. Whether they believe or not, I pray a blessing on them. I pray a blessing on their household. I pray, Lord God, that you would help them to prosper, Lord God, and be in good health, as your word says. And even as they prosper, their souls will prosper. I pray for the person who doesn't believe in you, Lord God, that you will just reveal yourself to them so that they will come to that knowledge that, yes, there is a superior being, and yes, you are involved in the lives of individuals on this earth. Father, thank you for what you're about to do. And we pray that we will hear the, 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 the testimonies, the good news, the good reports that, Lord God, you are still in the saving business. You are still in the mercy business. You are still in the redeeming business. Provide for each person who doesn't have, Lord God. Make a way for that person who is lost, Lord God. Restore the confidence and the, the, the peace of that individual who is troubled in their minds, Lord God. Restore marriages. Restore relationships between parents and children. Restore friendships, Lord God. And we pray in all this, we would give you thanks because you deserve it. You are God and there is none like you. And we glorify your name. And we pray in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. Amen. God is a good God. Ladies and gentlemen, we thank you for being with us today. We appreciate every single person who supports us in every way. Mm -hmm. Remember, if you check my description box, there's... You know the shop now page for t-shirts there's one true natural link and we just thank you once again be safe if you don't have to go on the street don't go don't let anybody use you as an experiment to see if virus is out there yes or no <laughs> only go outside when you need to and if you're going outside wear your mask otherwise stay home stay safe boost your immune system look at the health the, the natural health remedies stop eating fast food Cook a yard. We always say it and we keep on saying it. Live and laugh. Cook and eat. Cook and eat. Have yourself a wonderful day. And as you can see, we have done it. Today. We have taken this and turned it into that. So in other words, we turn with hand and make fashion. Blessings to you all. Have yourself an awesome day. Yay. Just a last look. <laughs> May I eat my dumpling? It's there. No, sir. The food tastes good, but not tell no lie. But it tastes so good. <laughs> but who cook it? <laughs> we cook the food. <laughs> mm -mm. No polish and sawfish. And with that, we are out, you guys. See you for another one next Thursday morning. Same time, same, same place. place, unless we get another out. <laughs> 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 but yeah, remember if you have not yet subscribed and you're watching right now, please go and hit the subscribe button. If you bell. are already subscribed but you have not hit the notification bell, hit that notification bell because we sometimes randomly go live at odd times that are not mm -hmm. scheduled. So you do not want to miss out on that. All right. So again, this video is brought to you by One True Natural.
go get <laughs> one, two, nacho. Have a great day and see you guys. Ah, peace. Ah, <laughs> uh, peace.